Hi guys, it's the 30th week of Ordinary Time and the word of this week is individuality. My name is Peace and this is Extraordinary. So what does individuality mean? Individuality means uniqueness and that we are all made different by God. We are all still equal, but we have our differences. So, as we start our time together, we'll make the sign of the cross. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. This week's Gospel is about the Pharisee and the tax collector. It's a parable that talks about the way they're praying, the fact that they're making very different prayers, and almost making assumptions. So, for example, the Pharisee is talking about being righteous and thanking God for that, and the tax collector is praying in forgiveness. Now, I think what's really good to get out of this gospel is the fact that we're all individual and we all have our own path to God. So, even though some people might seem to be struggling more, some people have different unique gifts and talents, um, we all have our own individual path to God. And that's why we really need to step outside the idea of what is normal or what is right, because sometimes there's no one right way to God. There's no one path in the sense of what is normal, because we are all individuals and we are all unique. So we have different struggles, we have different journeys and different gifts and talents that we can offer up to God. Therefore, it's really important to see everyone as the individual we are. And so we're really called to accept and love each other for who we are. So I now invite you guys to take a few minutes just in the silence of your own hearts and think about what makes you individual, whether that be your gifts, your talents, or your own experiences in life. So now we join together thanking God for creating us as individuals in the words of the Our Father. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil. Amen. So your mission this week is to just take some time and think about those individuals around you and the reasons why you love and care for them. It can be one reason why you care about someone who's an individual right by your side. In the name of the Father, the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. So thank you for listening, guys. This has been Extraordinary. Don't forget to click the subscribe button down below. And I will see you guys very soon. <laughs>